Hello there, ladies and gentlemen. It's actually three additional days after my previous recording. Yeah, I have done... Uh, let's see. I have recorded for about an hour since, uh, since my last recording, which was on a Tuesday. It's now Friday. And literally made no progress whatsoever. Most of the time just about consisted of me um, throwing myself around the crane area and not really benefiting from it at all. Uh, do I need to do anything here? Ah, right, okay. Yes, uh... But, however, I did find a new area, finally. And that was late last night. If we go over in this direction, then we can hop up here, it seems. Now, yeah, this takes us over to a new ledge, which I, I looked at quite a lot because there is a huge slope next to it, and I did try and propel myself across that slope a number of times, but to no avail, and this turns out to be the way to get to there. I'm quite surprised it took me so long to actually notice this, but yeah, it there is quite a lot beyond this. I didn't loot much, because obviously I wanted to share that experience with you guys. You see, this is the slope I was trying to get onto. It's right next to that bridge. You'll have to excuse me, the headset's slightly more tilted than usual, so it might be louder than usual. Um, it's because I now have three new additional chunks of metal in my ear which weren't there in the previous recording session. And of course I'm trying not to put my headset on top of them because that would hurt. Okay, so what do we have here? I mean, like, there's, there's quite a lot of routes to go, really. I think the most obvious one might be down here, because I did kind of spot it off-screen. if we go this way, I imagine. Yeah, I've thought as much. Right. If we loot this way, there we go. Oh, wait, wait, no. Oh, okay. Well, the one I spotted before is actually below us, and I've been trying to get to there. Now, I imagine there's another way to get down to there, but, um, not sure how we go about that. Now, there is this way as well. This means we're actually... yeah, we're, we're up on the roof now. Hmm. What kind of flags are those? Hmm. I think I've seen them when I went to London one time. I don't know what they represent, though. Shows how British I am. Right, okay, let's try the other route first, because I get the feeling that the other route perhaps is the non-level ending one, if you get what I'm saying. I'm kind of assuming we're actually near the end of the level here. We could be, like, miles and miles away from it. Hang on a moment. It's up this way, isn't it? So, we hop up here. Uh, luckily, I haven't saved that far away from here. It only takes about a minute to get to this point. I still need to collect the secrets every time I do it, though. And can we, um... I should keep an eye out, really. Can we climb up here? No. That's a slope. We don't want to go up there. And what do we have? Ah, right, okay, the camera angle's changed. There's a fire below us. And then there's also a ledge directly in front of us. I'm guessing the other side of that is a slope. It doesn't look like it's a good idea to go down here. Though we could well land just on the edge of the flame, maybe, and not set on fire. But I doubt that's going to happen, judging by how bloody huge Laura's hitbox is when it comes to the flames in Tomb Raider 2. Like, literally, you'd only need to be standing by the flames set on fire. Happened a few times around fireplaces and stuff like that, which is quite hilarious. Okay, we'll just go down this way for now. I thought I heard additional footsteps then, which could have implied that there was a guard around here, but doesn't seem to be the case. Okay, there's nothing below us. Nothing too interesting, anyway. We'll just keep going this way. I should probably consider turning the volume up on this, because it is quite quiet. Oh, there is a crow. There it is. Or two. Maybe. No, I think it's just the one. Okay, no problem. Ah, I see another save crystal. Or I thought I did. No, I definitely don't. What am I on about? I thought... Honestly, I thought I caught a glimpse of one then. Uh, Right, okay, we got two slopes. Nowhere we can go here, really, is there? There's just this button to push. 
Aha! Is this by any chance the one that was by the forklift? Uh, sorry, I mean the, um, the, you know we pushed a button near the, um, I still don't have a clue what it's called. The thing that workmen use to get up the side of buildings. Yeah, do you reckon it's that? And do you reckon this is going to turn the fire off and it's going to be timed? I bet it is. Let's see, shall we? We can turn it off, so I bet it is. Right, okay, so we're probably going to be have to, have to be fast with this, and we're probably going to end up dying a few times, but let's give it a go. Right. I would say we'd use the dash function, but I don't think it's going to be that useful. Right. That was a bit of a gamble there, because I didn't really know whether or not there was actually a gap down there. I completely forgot. Right, where do we go? It's like, I can't remember for the life of me. Um, That might be an edge, and it, yeah, it most certainly is. I should probably take my time and have a look at <laughs> this place before I decide to do this run. Let's give this another go, but this time let's actually take this slower. Because, I mean, I don't think there's much of a rush for this. So, it's around this way. I, I figured out that... What the hell? How did I miss that? I must be going blind. Huge gap in the way. My memory is so short sometimes. Right. Take three. <laughs> See if I can actually do this right this time and not throw myself off any edges. Right, so where is it? It's here. Right, no problem. Why did I even have any trouble with that before? Right, so it's, um. Here we turn around. And it's up this way. Now I'm gonna. I'm just gonna stand here and watch this flame for a moment. Just to make sure, of course, that it doesn't turn back. Oh, it's already on. Hmm. So has that switch activated something else, or...? Uh. Wouldn't know, would I? I mean, it could well have... It could have done anything, really. It could have moved the crane, for all I know. Which I doubt it's done, but still, it's entirely a possibility. I wish it would use more of the bloody... You know, the... I'll see if the button's turned off. That's always a good idea, isn't it? Because if it has turned off, then it may well be the flame. If it hasn't, then... It's probably somewhere else that I've missed. Let's see. No, it's still on. But what's this above it? Pretty sure that's just the casing that it was... being covered by, that was unlocked by... The little f bit by the. Oh, what it. We'll just try. Oh my god, why Why do I keep doing that? It's like as though I'm completely oblivious to that edge. Right, we'll try We'll try going the flame way instead. We'll activate that switch and then go the flame way. And hopefully, like, Laura will be okay, so to speak. Has that got higher? Or am I just imagining that? I believe. It has. But how do we get across to there? Yes, it definitely has. I mean, it was way further down before, wasn't it? Was it? I, I, I have no idea. I really don't have a clue. Mm. So what do we do? Do we jump down the flame bit? Is it worth the gamble? I don't know. I really don't know. I mean, the flame bit, it's like... You could jump across the other side of it, can't you? But it's going to take us the complete wrong way, I think. Oh, let's just go for it, shall we? I imagine, like... Wh where's the exit? Is there an exit? Or is it just instant death waiting to happen? It's a bit hard to tell, isn't it, really? If we could, like... I don't know. Is it on the other side? I think it is on the other side. If we could have have a look. I imagine actually it's on the left. Might be wrong though. Is it? Oh, it's impossible to see. It really is. Uh, well there's one way to find out. Let's get down there shall we? We'll just drop into the corner of it. Right here we go. We can go... Oh fuck okay I'm on fire. 
this is probably not worth it, but let's heal ourselves. <laughs> Laura is probably just permanently on fire now. Yeah. Well, at least I know where that leads to now. But, like, I don't think there's any chances of us actually um, getting through the fire. We could try and jump across to the other side and fall down that way. That might allow us, you know, enough time to actually get past the flame. Although I don't think that's going to happen, really. I think Laura's going to set on fire regardless of where she lands. Oh well. Right, that is way further down than it was before. So we definitely got to do something in regards to getting across to there, I think. Maybe from here, or maybe from the place where it's burning, but we definitely have to do something in regards to the, you know, the... thing. <laughs> Fuck knows what it's called. I don't think it's worth giving the fire another shot, to be honest. I don't think it's even possible to get across to there at all. Maybe, uh... Yeah, we can get across to there. We can get across to there, no problem. That's barely a jump away. It seems a, a tiny bit too high to be jumping from here. But I don't think we have another option, really. Let's give it a go. Yeah, there we go. Right, someone just shouted, though. I don't know where any is. But I imagine he's somewhere near here. Right. So what functionality does this place have? Oh, wait a minute. Is that a keyhole? There's a bird as well. Let's not get caught off by it. Or caught out, should I say. Right, so we're very nearby. Oh shit, there it is. There we go, problem solved. Okay, um, what, what, what on earth do I do here? Because I don't have a key. Apparently I can go down to there. Where, where does that take us down to, though? Oh, that's just, that's just back down to where we previously were. We don't want to go down there. Right, let's just go across to here. Hopefully, like, this isn't actually a key lock and it's a lever or something like that. Yeah, I can get the flares at least. Uh, I think it is a key. Oh, wait a minute, what? Flu room key. Okay, I never remember having this, picking this up, whatever. But... Yeah, apparently I do... did have it. Maybe Laura had it at the beginning of the level or something, I just never noticed. Well, let's get down there anyway. I imagine there's going to be a bad guy around here. Oh, there's another save crystal. That's cool. So I don't know where he's going to be. It's very dark in here as well. I'd quite like to get a flare out. But, too afraid to put my guns away, really. Right, nothing here. This looks like a death trap, though. It really does. And what's that? It's a button, I think. Oh, actually, there's nothing in here. So what was the music all about at the beginning? still looks like a death trap. Right, let's get a flare out then, shall we? It's very dark in here. There's rain coming through there. How? There's a roof. Right, this is a bit of a waste of a flare. Let's uh, actually have a look around, shall we? I don't think there's anything here apart from a, a weird camera angle, apparently, and that there. There might be pullable blocks somewhere, though. I don't think there is, but Still, it's worth a look. With the remaining flare we have now. Okay, never mind. Let's just press the button and see what it does. Hopefully something useful. Oh, it's turned the fire off. Right. But it's turned... this fire on. Hmm. How often does that go? Quite often. Oh shit! Aw, oh, she didn't stop! Right, well there's nothing I can do about that, is there? I'll just have to try that again. At least we've actually made some progress though there. It's like, how often does the flame go on and off?
Not very, actually. I'm pretty sure we could just run that normally. Yeah, we can. And this one's even smaller, so this shouldn't pose a problem at all. We just run straight past this one. Okay, I don't know what the problem was there. Right, what what do we do from here then? I mean, like, is there a quicker way we can get back up, or have we got to go all the way around again? If we got to go all the way around again, I'm tempted to save. I get the impression we are. Hmm. Uh, it doesn't look like there's another way to get back up. Just wondering if it's actually possible to jump across there. I think that's there for a reason, and that's to no. No, we can't get across there. Yeah, we're we're probably going off here just by hopping down to there. Yeah, thought as much. Right. Okay. So um, yeah. Quick. I'll do a quick um, quick cut while we get back to where we were previously. Right. We're finally back here. Oh my god! Right, what was that? Oh, I think there's a guy down there. Or I'm certainly assuming there is. He doesn't seem too phased by us. Oh, is he doing the walking around in a circle thing? Whoa, okay, he stopped. Uh, I think this is a good time to heal, and also a good time to mention that I did injure myself slightly getting here. It wasn't too bad, but still it was significant, you know, and completely unintentional. You bastard, you frighten me so much. I hope you drop something. So that would compensate for the fact that you literally shit me up so much there. No, you haven't got anything. You are a dick, sir. Like, if you would have dropped something, I would have just taken that as a a nice apology, but you clearly haven't. <sighs> what an idiot. Right, okay. Hopefully the flo I guess that's who shouted. Before, you know. Right. I hope the flame hasn't turned back on, because if it has, that would just be horrible. No, it hasn't. Cool. So we can finally find out what's actually down here. A slope. Right. Hmm. No, I think this is okay. I think the platform at the end... Yeah, it's cool. Because it's this one. It's the bit where the uh, thing that I still don't have a clue what the name of it is, is positioned. So how do we get into this hole without actually murdering ourselves? Because I could well actually just hit the top of that and die. Um, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to do this. Because I don't trust my ability to actually get into there. It works. It works. Right, we've got another save crystal. It's quite a surprise, really. Um, is that a sl It's a slope. Okay, that's cool. That's all good. Where's this taking us? We're going underground, that's for certain. But, like, this is a bit odd. Wasn't expecting to... No, we're not going underground. We're still, like... We're, we're just in the building, aren't we? Right, I'm gonna... Uh, should I? I've saved so much in this level, but let's go for it. We have found two additional save crystals, so I don't see the harm in that. I think we've saved four times now. I'll try to make that my last, but like... Oh, come on, let's get a flare out here, it's really dark. Oh, oh there's rats. No problem. Can we pick that back up by any chance? Thank you. Right, what else do we have here? I mean, what, what, what's all this going on down here? Oh, there's guards. Somewhere. Here. Wait a minute, I think that was a... Should I have killed him? I'm kind of wondering... No, he, he he had the same voice as the other god. Forget it. Oh, he disappeared. Right, he he just disappeared. That's cool. That's fine. If he wants to disappear, he's more than welcome to. Right, what do we have here? Wasn't that... Uh, that's another one of these buttons, and it's covered up. We have a weird kind of locker thing. We have a, another button here. Let's turn this from cold to hot. Um, fuck knows what. 
that dude. Yeah, literally fuck knows what that did. It's very noisy though. And what's beyond here? We've got a little cover, but there's something over it. A little emergency thing above it as well. Huh. This is a bit odd. I have no idea what that just did. We can turn it off. Should we just leave it off, or should we have it on? I don't know. I'll leave it on. I'll, I'll, I'll put it on hot for now. And let's proceed to go down this corridor here. Wait. No, it's not affecting that. I don't know what it's affecting, to be honest. Right, okay, let's, uh, let's proceed down this corridor anyway. This kind of looks a bit familiar. In an odd kind of way, really. Doesn't appear to be anything around that corner. It's almost like I've seen this before. I really doubt it, though. I don't think I've ever touched Tomb Raider 3. We established this before, that I may well have played Tomb Raider 4 when I was a kid, but not really realised it. Right, okay, let's uh, get a flare out, because it's kind of dark again where there's no light. And we'll just check down the side of these boxes here, or wherever the hell they are. Right, I don't think there's anything. We kind of check these ones up this way. No. Okay, let's, uh... Let's go through here. First. And we'll see if anything interesting lies beyond here. Is that water? Okay, that... That... that I don't really expect to find water in here, but alright. Like, technically we're still in a building, aren't we? If not, we're kind of under the building. Is there anything down here? Something is making a very strange noise, that's for certain. Very strange noise. Is that a little red fish there? Or am I just imagining things? Sounds kind of electric. Perhaps I shouldn't be in here. Though I don't think that is the case. Uh, can we climb up here? Because otherwise I don't think this room has much of a purpose really, does it? At the moment. It might. It may have something to do with the, um, the switch though. As I mentioned. Okay. Uh, let's check the other ones first, and then we'll just assume that it has something to do with the switch, and we'll check the other room first. No. Okay, I don't think there's anything on the other ones. It's worth a look, though. We did we did pull the switch down, didn't we? So it was it was changed from its default. Uh, how odd. So maybe this maybe the lever drains the water out. I don't know. Let's give the next room a go. Go down here. And through here. Oh, another room of water. Once again, how strange. Uh, that appears to be a lever right in front of us. It's a very oddly positioned lever. It seems to be on a door or something. Uh, da -da 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 -da. Right, what else do we have here? There must be something else. Oh, there's an exit there. And then... That seems to be about it, really. Let's check it, shall we? Yeah. It's taking us somewhere. Not entirely sure where. The colour of this room's very odd. I like it, really. I... Yeah, I definitely do. Uh... Right. And here we have a room that appears to kind of lack a bottom to it. Oh no, it does have one. This looks like it m should be full of water too, so let's assume that is something that we need to do. And I'm kind of guessing that the lever may adjust where the water is, if you get what I'm saying. Oh, I, I see things on the floor. I didn't notice those before. Should I check the other room now? 
because it clearly shows that my eyesight's a bit shit. Let's go up for air before we pull this lever. Okay. And here we go. See what it does. Right, it opens the room. Sorry, the door in the other room. So we'll go back there now, and that will give us opportunity to actually check to see if um, the floor did have some items on it, which I doubt it does, but it's worth a look, isn't it? So any items are really useful. Hmm. I think we're going to be going back and forth between these areas quite a lot, to be honest, because um, as you saw, the first room contained a couple of areas that were shut off, so... Right, where's this? Right, it's there, okay. So we'll go up for air here and then we'll go down. Here goes. Hopefully we won't drown in this. Right. Okay, what do we have here? Oh, God. Right, that's not good. No, that's definitely not good. Huge fan. Huge ass fan. That's probably going to chop us up, isn't it? Yeah. Well, this is going to be very hit and miss, isn't it? By that I mean it's kind of going to be very hit. Let's give it a go. Maybe, maybe the... Um... No, there's no way we can bloody compete with that. I'm just wondering may, uh, if the other lever actually controls that fan. It may well do, although... I'm not 100% certain that is the case. It's worth a go. I don't know if it has any other purpose. We may as well moderate it to see exactly what it does. Here goes. It doesn't appear to have made much of a noise this time. Maybe it doesn't work anymore because we've actually done something. Ah. Right, the water level has actually dropped significantly there. Not sure this is any good, but still we can get down into here, so that's no problem. And I don't think it will affect the fans. No. Oh! Actually, they've, they're, they appear to be a lot slower now. So probably were meant to have done that. Oh, I've just gone through the wall. Wait a minute, is that a secret? It may well be a secret, actually. Let's uh, get back down there and try again. I don't think it is, but it's worth a look. Uh, maybe not. No, I think it's just a glitch. Yeah, definitely is. Never mind. Okay, so let's give the fans a go. I think we're probably going to get chopped up, like I said, but it, there's less chance of it now, at least. Right, why the hell is Laura kind of glitching out here? Right, here goes. Uh, how close are we to this? Uh... Oh, come on, Laura. Yeah, there we go. Apparently they're not actually doing any damage now, so it's all cool, but we're kind of struggling to get past them. There we go. That's cool. That works. I'm happy with that. So, that was the purpose of that. I'm just going to go down and check if there's anything I missed down there, which I doubt there is, but... Also, it's just coming on to 9 o'clock, so I'm expecting a phone call. So I'm going to have to do a bit of your being here, if that's okay. Well, let you guys have a choice. Sorry. I'll see you in a moment. <laughs> 